Hello everyone, welcome back to Moldy Tacos Gaming and welcome back to Stardew Valley and welcome to my laundry room. Uh, it's late, I have to work tomorrow and I don't care because I'm going to... Oh, it is raining. Oops. No, oh, my sunflowers are ready. Here's the best thing ever about sunflowers is as you pick them... You get seeds. Um, and I believe sunflowers are summer or fall. Yeah, summer or fall. So these seeds will actually carry over into the next season. We got some peppers as well. What? Okay, so we are doing well. Um, I think today's a big day to make some money. I didn't mean to drop them like that. That looks ugly. Oh, well. It's going to be all right. So I don't have to water today, which is great. Um, wait a minute. It's raining. Tomorrow, we're all gathering at the beach for an annual Pelican Town Luau. Highlight of the event is the communal potluck. Make sure you bring something good to contribute. That's too hot as fuck. Okay. So, now... Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab these. And we're going to... No, I shouldn't yet. You know what I am gonna do, though? I'm gonna... Oh, no, 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 no. I'm an idiot. I know exactly what I'm going to do. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Right, we're going to... I'm going to put this guy... Oh, yeah. I'm going to put this guy away. First, I'm going to take all that bait out. I'm going to put that guy away. I think I need a sunflower for the... <laughs> I totally forgot about the... Um... I totally forgot about the drum. <laughs> no, I just walked past it. <laughs> Okay, those are my appointments for next week. Let's see. Fish. Farming. Tomato. Blueberry. Melon. Got it. I could have swore that I needed... Don't be rude. Tomato. Blueberry. Melon. I don't have those ready yet. Corn. Eggplant. Okay. Okay. I could have swore that I needed a sunflower for my community center, but I'm not seeing it. So oh, we're just going to sell all this. I, I'm like 99% sure we need a sunflower. So we are going to bring a sunflower and then we're going to go fishing. Oh, that's what I was doing. What the hell? One second, fish. What can I get in the summer in the rain? A red snapper, of course. But I can't do it with my normal fishing pole. Wait. I'm going to bring that fishing pole just in case because there's a chance I don't have enough money for the new one. And, uh, see, I remembered it was there now. So we're going to bring this fishing pole as like a just in case um, because I'm pretty sure it's like 9,500. And then we're going to go to the community center after the community center. Then we will be heading. Oh, look at, look, 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 look. How did I do that? I'm happy. Okay. Um, so we're going to go to the community center only because I'm... Oh, I still have 18 hot peppers. That's all right. I really wish that I could make a lightning rod, but I don't think that I can. No, because that's how you get batteries is during the electrical storms. Okay, so we're going to go back in here. And since it's not on my list that I need a sunflower... Hey. 
And there it is. Okay, so sea urchin I find on the beach. Red cabbage I have no idea. And a duck feather I need a duck for. So, we're going to try to upgrade our fishing pole right now. And then we are going to head to go fishing in the rain to catch us a red snapper. And we're going to spend all day fishing, which we can now do because of the fact that uh, it's 11 a.m. and I don't have anything to water. Should I pick these up? I should probably. I can sell them if I don't have enough money. See? Gamer strats. 100% uh, guaranteed wins. Oh, it's 7,500. We had plenty. I'm going to sell these anyways. Okay, and then do I have enough for a dress spinner? I do. Okay. <laughs> Big plays, everybody. So I don't need you anymore. So we will be boxing this guy here as soon as we get back to our house. There we go. Then we're going to go outside. We're going to need a trout suit. We don't need it. And then I will see you in roughly 11 and a half hours. First one. First one. I got the red snapper. Uh, no big deal. All right, guys, this is going to be our last cast of the night because we keep on throwing stuff away. Um, we had a huge fishing day, um, but our inventory is completely stocked up full and broken glasses. Okay, so now our inventory is completely full. We caught a red snapper on the first cast, but it was iridium. So, of course, I had to keep going because I want to sell that. So... Now, what we can do is we can go and we can complete our ocean bundle, which is huge. And then we're going to look at what we need to do to unlock Calico Desert. Um, and to do that, we have to get the bus running again, which should be pretty simple. Um, the bundles for it are so easy. Okay, here's your red snapper for a complete bundle, and I just realized I have a full inventory. So I can't take these warp totems for the beach. Mm, you know what? It's going to be alright. We're going to drop it. And then... Should I eat the berries? I'm going to eat the berries. For the warp totem, it's worth it. Trust me. Okay, so here is what is going to happen. We're going to eat these berries. And then I'm going to show you how we're going to unlock the Calico Desert. And it's one of the bundles that we have not yet completed. Okay, so now we have our warp totems. Perfect. It's going to be this bundle right here. Right there, reward bus repair. So we've already bought the first one. Now we need 10,000, 5,000, and 25,000. So that means we need 40,000 gold to finish these bundles. And as soon as we unlock those, the next day we can go to Calico Desert and we can get our sandfish. Now really quick, let me mark off my ocean bundle that is now complete. So that means that we have two of the five bundles. The other two we have to wait for fall. And one of them, it has to be raining in the fall. Uh, so 
that one's going to be a fun wait. And then the Sandfish is the last specialty one, which we'll get in Calico Desert. So we just need money. We need 40,000 gold, but with this fishing day, I think that's going to make a huge dent in it. Um, if I had to guess, I'd say we'll probably make about 5,000 off of this haul for the day. Because we, well, and we also had our, <laughs> the drum, we also had our, um, our crops for the day too. Clear and sunny tomorrow, perfect for the luau, right? Because I'm going to bring a very spicy pepper <laughs> and put it in there. We're going to see what happens. Uh, okay, almost 5000 So that's almost $7,000 that we made in a single day of fishing. Unfortunately, now our fishing is done until... Um, until... tomorrow tomorrow these will should should be ready tomorrow i'll say okay but everything's looking great everything's coming up i don't see anything dying which is a good thing and i will see you when i'm done watering Okay, everything is watered except for the dog. So, I'll pet the bull. We're going to water the dog. And then, we're going to go over here. Let's see what's ready in here. I did see there was a pepper ready behind the scarecrow. That I did not pick yesterday, which sucks. Because that means for the rest of the season, every pepper that comes ready, that one will come one day after everything else. Uh, but we can sell the pepper, the plum, the blackberry, the blackberry. And then the drum snare. I'm going to take one hot pepper down to that luau. Oh, you know what? We can throw this in here to be forgotten forever. Yay. And we're going to do that to the beach totems as well. Uh, because we can use those on like a rainy day. Um, like when I need to catch the eel in the fall when it's raining in the ocean. So let's go to town. And the luau has started. So there's not going to be anyone up here. So I can't upgrade anything. I can't do anything. Except for go to the luau. But, oh, what are you doing, Lewis? The luau started. What are you... The, the Chancellor or whatever is here. Tonka soup? Plus two to farming? What? The saloon gets pretty lively at night. Okay. Good talk, Lewis. Let's see. Abigail still at two hearts. But I can't do anything about that because it's the luau time. Okay, so you can come down here. You can add something to the soup. I'm going to put a hot pepper in there. Because this man is the governor. What a lovely occasion. It's always a joy to visit Stardew Valley. Look sharp. The governor's here for his annual visit. If you brought something for the potluck, make sure and hold it, add it to the soup cauldron. Okay. Where is my girl? I don't see her. I don't see her. Did you just got a star fruit chilling? Okay. I mean, I thought he would have more cool stuff. Where is she? Oh, there she is. She's out on the dock. I wonder I couldn't see her. It's tiring to socialize with everyone. I'd rather watch the sea. I'd rather watch you. 
That's a, a little joke. We usually, like, in my house, we do the two-eyed wink, we call it. Should we move forward with the luau? The governor seems a little hungry. Let's start. I put a hot pepper in there, buddy. You're done for. Well, folks, it's time once again for the potluck ceremony. I trust that you all put high-quality ingredients in the pot this year. We don't want the governor to regret his visit to the valley. I'm going to put gold. I didn't put iridium. Well, governor, would you do us the honor of tasting the soup? Of course. I've been looking forward to this all year. Hmm. I don't have much to say about this. It's an average soup. I wanted to burn his butthole. What? He's right. It's nothing special. Not bad, though. Well, who else wants some soup? Me. The soup was just average, but otherwise the luau was a success. Time to head home. I said, does that count as talking to her for the day? It sure does. Okay, drum snare. Okay, these are not ready. I'm hoping they're ready tomorrow. Hey, dog. Go to sleep for the night? Yes, please. I don't think we made much because of the luau. No, we made 250 gold. 245 to be exact. Okay, and here we go on our last day in which we will not be drum snare. These are still not ready, so they must be ready tomorrow. Oh, what are you, though? Oh, we got some coffee. Okay, I suppose I will see you guys all when it is watered again. Okay, everything has been watered but the dog. And the bull has not been pet. Okay, so what I think we're going to do, bear with me here, is we're going to put all of our stuff away. And we are going to head to the mines. I have not checked luck, so I suppose we'll do that before we go as well. Drum snare. Snare drum, I guess. Good humor today. Have a little extra luck. Okay. So not an amazing day, but a good day. Snare drum. I cannot wait for those melons to be ready. Uh, should be tomorrow, which will be in a new episode. Which means a new recording session, and I will forget completely about it and get excited all over again for it. Alright, let's get down to 85. Because getting to Calico Desert is cool. But you're gonna want to um, go into Skull Cavern, which we have to complete this level first to do. Um... We also need, I think it's a skill level of eight in the mines so that we can go ahead and uh, make some explosive ammo before we get to Skull Cavern. So no matter what, we, we want to get farther in these mines. Uh, this is not giving me a whole lot of energy, but it's giving me some. So that's all right, I guess. And then we've got this stew that we pulled out of the trash as a, an emergency kind of meal. Only because it does plus two to farming, and I'm not quite sure what that means. Um, but I think we want to eat it before we harvest. Okay, so we have plenty of inventory spots. 
It is 1140. I would like to get at least to 95, but I don't know. Oh, oh. You know, it's looking more and more likely every second. Wow, he hits hard. And he's not really knocked back by my attacks. He didn't drop anything for me. But I think I see some diamond ore right, right below us. Okay, so this is where things start getting dangerous here in the mines. Um, because things start hitting you very hard. Oh no, it's Aquamarine. Okay. Now there's a hole, but it's right next to a guy. So we're just gonna sneak around him. Okay. Deeper into the mines. We are at 88. Two more levels. We're at 90. And it's 1 p.m. So I don't know if we're hitting 95 today. But, I mean, a man can dream, right? And then we have to sell enough to make it to Calico Desert, which was 40 grand, so we are $32,000 away. Uh, but that harvest, as soon as that harvest comes in, should be major. Hopefully, anyhow. Um, I think I have plenty of energy for now. But I, I'm worried about overextending on accident. Okay, a magma geode, not bad. If I could get a ladder, that'd be great. This one's got a ladder under it. Nope. It's trying to breathe it into existence. And that obviously didn't work, so neato. Okay. Now, every episode that we have a special event... It's probably going to be a shorter episode, if I'm being honest. Just because that takes up, like, the entire day, but it only takes a couple of minutes. Which is fine. Nothing wrong with a shorter episode. Oh, and there it is. And here comes this guy, who hits, like, a brick shit house. But so do I. Okay, nothing good there. <laughs> We're going to dodge. Emergency situation. Oh, wow, that did a whole bunch. Okay, we got some Void Essence. That's good. We're going to take out this guy. Pretty easily. And now it's all about finding a ladder, which is right under this rock. Oh, come on. Eventually, I got. Eventually, I got to breathe it into existence, right? That's all right, cause it's right under here. Nope. It sure wasn't. Okay, so we're gonna use up a bunch of energy getting down to ninety here. Um, I believe that magma is the last level of these mines. So from here, we just got some hard-hitting guys for the rest of the time that we're in these mines. Which will be fine, I think. Um, by the end of this season, I would like to... There we go. What have we got here? The Obsidian Edge. You guys, this is what I wanted. 30 to 45 damage, minus 1 speed, but 10 crit power. 15 to 24 damage. Versus this 30 to 45. So big. Let's go test it out, shall we? Is this copper ore? I'm actually offended right now. And this is what the obsidian edge does. It just melts defense. I don't think we've seen one of these guys before. They breathe fire, and we one-shot them. So, that's neat. Okay, so the Obsidian Edge is a really good weapon. And we're still going for that best item in the game. Oh, got a ruby. 
Not too shabby. Okay, we're down to 91 now. We have no food. I've got two of these guys. Let's see if we can get them one at a time. Nope, we sure can't. Oh, wait, maybe. There we go. Just like that. Ooh, he got me twice. Okay, so there's these fire bats that we were having trouble with. And three shots there down. And we got a bomb. That's so good. So I'm just going to lay this guy like right here. Which is going to fully expose this guy here. For another crab. Two crabs in a row. We got a staircase. We got fire bats coming in. And I'm not afraid of them anymore. Two shot at that one. I thought I heard two. Oh. Watch. So three crabs in a row and another bomb. And another staircase. So we don't even have to walk back. You know, it said, okay, luck today, but I'm calling BS on that. We're doing amazing. I think that's not going to pick up. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this copper. Oh, you know what? We're going to take this fiber and toss it. We don't need no fiber. This guy shoots fireballs. And we're going to dispatch him with ease. I am suddenly way more brave down here with this obsidian edge. And I just really hope that's not misplaced. It is 840, so we're gonna wanna watch that. But we only have two levels to go, but still no food. Oh, couldn't give me a free level. You know, I'm gonna be honest, I completely forgot that existed. <laughs> You know what? Here, we're going to do this. We're going to go like this. And like that. There we go. Okay. We're going to be fine. gonna be fine I just have to focus a lot I'm gonna take these bats out you know up here we got a slime and that guy. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Stop freaking out, audience. It's definitely you and not me freaking out. Okay, we got two more enemies down here. I'm just going to hedge my bets ever so slightly. Okay. We're going to be fine. We have 10 health. I believe I'm one shot. I told you we were going to be fine. Wait, is that... It's Squid Ink. We need that. It's 11.30. We need to hurry. And find the stairs. Because otherwise we're donezo. <laughs> oh, we're so low energy too. There's no more enemies. I know it's getting late. Leave me alone. I'm trying my best here. We really need to upgrade our inventory space. 
Just, just give me the ladder. I can't eat the crab. Oh no. Will I pass out if I keep doing this? Where's the ladder? Oh no! It's one. <laughs> Guys, we might pass out. Yep, there it is. We're done. Oh no! We were one away! Level 5 combat. Okay. Um, let's do scout. Critical strike chance increases by 50%. But we leveled up, which means we wake up with full energy and it's a rainy day, guys. Is this ready? It is not. But we have peppers. And our inventory is too full for that. Okay. So tomorrow we will be selling and harvesting and mining. I would like to thank you so much for showing up and watching. Quiet, don't interrupt me. Thank you so much for showing up and watching. I appreciate it so much. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you next time. And until next time, bye!